I make Bob Barker look like a teenager? <laughs> Tonight, we're talking to the candidates for governor of New York. With me, his father was once a governor, Andrew Cuomo. Thank you, Larry. It's nice to be here. He's the Democrat, and his Republican candidate, who loves to send emails and talk smack about the gays, please welcome Carl Palladino. Thank you, Larry. It's also very nice to be here. That's it? Nothing crazy? Please say you're going to admit you have an illegitimate kid. Please! I mean, I need the ratings. I want to go out on top. They've got an English guy from a reality show replacing me, and guess what? It's not Simon. <laughs> Larry, I'm trying very hard not to say anything out of line right now. Well, this is gonna be boring. Good thing I've got an ace in the hole. That's right. This guy will not only entertain you, he will also make these nut jobs go crazy. Please welcome the man with the catchphrase that's the 2010 Yes We Can. The rent is too damn high. That's right, Jimmy McMillan from the Rent is Too Damn High Party. Let's hear it for him. Yes. Thanks for being here, Jimmy. Thank you, Larry. The rent is too damn high. People can't afford things to buy, like a brand new tie. <laughs> or a salami on rock. It's certainly not a piece of the American pie. Why? Because the rent is too damn high. Oh, I love this guy. All right, our first question. New York is still a terrorist target. How will you save the state? Jimmy, let's start with you. As an expert on Xbox, <laughs> I know that fear of attacks reduces rents in New York City, which is a good thing because the rent is too damn high. Spoken like an awesome person. <laughs> let's turn it over to Carl Palladino. Terrorists, what do you think? Well, <clears throat> when I'm governor, you can be damn sure terrorists aren't going to be blowing up anything. Speaking of blowing, I was at a gay pride parade one time and two guys were just blowing this. Damn it, Carl! Oh, that was awesome. The nut job has come open. Andrew Cuomo, your thoughts? Larry, have you, have you been listening to these guys? I mean, with opponents like this, I don't have to do anything but sit back and I'm gonna win this thing by a landslide. Look at them. Very true, very true. Next up, unemployment. Now, unemployment in New York is at an all-time high. How will you put the people of New York back to work? Let's start with you, Jimmy McMillan. As a Pinkberry expert, <laughs> let me fix mine. Yeah, fix it. I will hire one million people to canvas New York City and speak to all the landlords in town and ask them to reduce the rent because the rent is too damn high. Love this guy. Paladino, what do you got for me on the world of jobs? Jobs? Jobs. Let me tell you about jobs. We got blow jobs, hand jobs, rim jobs. I have no self-control. You do not indeed, and I love it. Cuomo, unemployment? Uh, Larry, I'm at 69%. You hear that? 69%. Hold it together, Carl. Do not make a 69 joke, Carl. Oh, go ahead, do it. No? Fine. Let's sum up in one sentence how you would be the best candidate for New York governor. Let's start with you, my man, the beard guy, Jimmy McMillan. I would be a good candidate for mayor governor of New York because... Because... The rent is too damn high. Oh, there it is. I hope this guy wins. <laughs> Paladino, your thought. Oh, I'm sorry. I checked out there. I've just been uh, sending messages to my buddy of a picture of a girl blowing a horse. You have lost. <laughs> Cuomo, what you got? Oh, Larry, I could probably go to Times Square right now, hire a hooker, do blow off her tits in front of everybody, and I would still beat these guys. The you know what? I'm gonna go do that right now. <laughs> Cuomo is bringing hookers back to the governor's mansion in New York. That's his platform. Well, that's all the time we have. I'd like to thank the weird beard guy, the pervert guy, and our next governor. And I'm Larry King now. 
Dennis and Cooper, that bastard! Yeah.